Good morning you guys. I'm going now uh, to San Jose to explore San Jose. What there is to do. I'm going uh, for the first time uh, to a Philippine barber shop because uh, my hair must be tied it up a little bit. It's becoming too long. So uh, yeah, let's go to uh, San Jose City. Now it's uh, all tears uh, day, so maybe there are some things to do in San Jose. I don't know, but uh, we're gonna explore it anyway. Yeah. We're uh, at the barber shop, so it will be my uh, my first time in a barber shop in the Philippines. So I'm, uh, I don't know what to expect, but I, uh, I heard they uh, are truly a uh, hair artist here, so uh, here we go. If you are here in the Philippines, you must uh, also uh, go to a barber shop because it's very special. If you want to be integrated uh, in the Filipinos uh, community, then go to a barber shop. I look very nice and young now. The traffic situation here is unbelievable. I cannot drive here. 
very crowded here. I don't know how they can drive here, but it's quite impressive, I must say. Barbershop. I'm enjoying now uh, here in San Jose at McDonald's a uh, good cup of coffee. I was in a need of a good cup of coffee. I hope it's better without the beer because I think he didn't understand me quite well to tighten up my beer, but he shaved it all off. But hey, it can still grow, no hard feelings. It's really, uh, really nice here in San Jose. I didn't expect it to uh, be like this. Everything has been destroyed by the typhoon and still the people are very friendly and warm. So for me, it's overwhelming to see how the Philippine people uh, still enjoy life after such a terrible tragedy, you know. Very good coffee, by the way. But I'm very surprised, uh, very good heart. Air uh, artists they have here. I still enjoy it here every day. Also, it's quite remote here. This island is very remote. There are coming a lot of uh, visitors here, but not like Palawan or Boracay. It's not too crowded here, so you have still place to discover some things. <laughs> <laughs> 